those who have asked, here's an overview of January 2. I used a Santa Clara Marine Thai wood. And just like this outrigger, I used the same wood and I epoxied all over. They have compartments inside. They have several compartments just in case. So for safety purposes, I did that. And she's a 17 plus footer. And the majority of the bulkhead wood that was used is made of mahogany. Under the hood, you can find a Color Command Pro 10. It's 10 horsepower. It is an, it's a gasoline engine. It's good enough to power my boat. I've customized my exhaust so that it goes to the back using a stainless tube. My throttle, it's uh, made from wood. And here is the compartment where the battery and electronics go. Okay, the wires are topsy-turvy now, but I'm going to fix that. Here is the fish finder. It's an Echo, Gar it's a Garmin Echo 150. And I have put two holes where the transducer and the battery line will go through the steering wheel. It's made from a kid's bicycle wheel. That wheel. Okay, in the steering system, I had, uh, I got a block of wood. I had it uh, rounded in a, in a lathe in a machine shop okay now it's a string and pulley system it goes through the PVC tube goes right around it it hugs the boat goes through the back I epoxy it to the boat and there an inverted U rudder system so it's a string it's a modified string and pulley steering system modified because I don't actually use a pulley any pulley I just use the curve of the of the PVC there goes my fish finder the transducer I permanently secured it to the wing of my boat and there the wires go through there and down and back up goes back up to the wire compartments which I'm gonna clean up in a few days <clears throat> so okay here you can find the rod holders here and here the front two rod holders I'm gonna put two more one here and one there and maybe another one in there in my GoPro holder uh, I'm gonna lift it up a bit there it goes in the bow Here's the front compartment where I can place life jackets, dry bags, whatever. Okay, and so that's basically it. If you have any questions, you can PM me. Feel free to ask. I'd be happy to share with whatever I learned building this boat. See you in the waters. Bye bye.